morning, my people. And as you know, this is Toko Farms. And so my channel, where you learn how to build black soldier fly from eggs to maturity. And it's also on my channel, where you learn how to breed them perfectly. And it's also on my channel, where you learn new tricks on how to breed them perfectly. Today is the 29th of January 2021 and I just want to make a quick video and also give you some important tips on how to breed your flies, how to breed your lava during this Amatan period. Now, as you can see, if you are practicing and outdoor breeding it will be very difficult for you to control the temperature and humidity of the outdoor breeding because it's always dry and it's always cold but if you're practicing the indoor breeding it will be very very easy for you to control the humidity and temperature and you can see this is my indoor breeding and if you look at the humidity, the humidity is staying, staying at uh, 6% and temperature is 32.7 degrees centigrade, which is okay for me. But as you can see, inside this big love cage, the flies are not flying, you know, there's no much activities inside my love cage. Why? There's no sun. Only few of them are flying around. They're just flying. There's nothing like mating. As you can see, look at all of them. They are just, you know, resting at the walls. Look at inside this love cage. They are all resting at the walls. Look at them over there. They are doing nothing. And what do you need this black soldier fly? to do for you you want them to do you want them to lay eggs in a very short time you don't need to prolong the laying of eggs you need them to lay eggs at the right time before they die it was all the flies you are looking at in less than 10 days they are gone they are all going to die yes that is it even if I have a lot of flies inside this room, in less than 10 days, they are all going to die. But you... Okay, what I'm saying is that you need a very short time to make them mate and lay eggs before they die. For example, your flies hatch out from the pupa on Monday. And by Tuesday and Wednesday, you let them mate. On Thursday, Friday or Saturday, they are able to lay their eggs. So, within 6 to 7 days, you have achieved all this. Even if they die on the 8th day, it's none of your business. Because they have already laid the eggs. So, if you are practicing an outdoor breeding and you did not take any necessary precautions, like how to control the weather, you know, by covering your love cage with this thick tarpaulin. And if you don't do that, your flies will die quickly. Even some of them would hatch out from the pupa. So, if you're practicing an indoor breeding, to control the temperature is very easy. And as you can see, this is my love cage, and the whole room is also my love cage, as you all know. There's no much activity. They are only flying around because I am inside the love cage. As you can see, look at them. No much movement. No much movement. And if you enter my love cage and you stay like one hour, you know that <laughs> it is very cool. I mean, it is warm. Not that warm, but it's okay. Temperature is okay for them. So, and I want them to meet instantly. I hold my artificial light 247. I don't off it 
because I want them to meet and lay their eggs in a very short time. So now I'm going to on the light just for you to see the difference. Yeah. This type of light that I use and that's it over there too. So I'm going to on it now and see what will happen. Maybe they are going to meet or they are not going to meet. And from this cage, you too you can duplicate this type and construct this type so that you'll be able to, you know, extract your eggs there every two or three days. Depending on how many pupa you introduce into your love cage. And this type of my love cage, the maximum pupa I can introduce in there is from 5k, I mean 5kg to 7kg pupas. So now let me hold on the light just for you to see their activities. So let's see what will happen. As you can see, look at what is happening. You can hear the sound of their wings flying around. <clears throat> it's meeting time. It's meeting time. Look at that. Too much activities. You can hear the sound. Look at that. signifies meeting time. Look at them. Look at them. Look at them. Look at them. So with this, you'll be able to make them lay eggs in time before they die. So once again, this is Two Call Farms. If you like subscribe to my channel, please do it by clicking on the subscription button and also on the notification bell. And that will notify you whenever I upload new videos. And you can also like and share my videos.